Stormont Estate in Belfast was the venue for this year's Red Bull Soapbox Race, the longest, steepest and some might argue wackiest soapbox event to take place in Ireland to date. Bring to mind an oversized tea trolley or a bed on wheels and you might get the picture. 44 teams were chosen to build a non-motorised soapbox and although the rivalry is jovial, engineering students from Queen's University Belfast were using this event to break the world record for the fastest soapbox run. And in order to perfect their design, they brought their craft to the Red Bull Racing UK Formula 1 team factory in Milton Keynes. There they received advice from the Formula 1 team's chief designer, Rob Marshall. It's fundamentally the same principle as a standard soapbox. The only thing different is this fiberglass body. We spent lots, lots and lots of hours working on this, weekends, etc. When we were designing it, we modelled it in computer-aided design, which basically gave us a template of a human being, so how we could fit in uh, the human inside the actual cell perfectly. They gave us a very good tip, actually, for uh, cutting down the rolling resistance of the tyres, and uh, hopefully we'll fill them with a special substance. It's not untypical. We, we, we tend to try and introduce these type of projects to give the students something exciting to really sort of get their teeth into, really give them, a, give them an opportunity to practice um, the type of theory that we sort of learn in their, their typical courses. The Queen's University uh, entrance into this year's Soapbox Challenge is, is very interesting. I mean, compared to the usual entrance that consists of bedsteads and uh, different contraptions, this is way more sophisticated. And you can see a great deal of thought has gone into the aerodynamics and the principles between um, low drag and low friction uh, the same principles are involved with making a quick race car at the end of the day. So I'm very impressed with what I've seen and I'm sure they're going to uh, challenge for overall honours. successful outing was had, smashing the previous record with a lightning speed of 45 miles per hour. Well done. Well, our target was to achieve around about 40 miles an hour. That would have been fantastic to have achieved that. And then to have achieved actually 45 miles an hour over the 550 metres was absolutely great. Before we had to put on the brakes here towards the end. But um, yeah, absolutely great.